Hi, this is Jonathan Glimmer, aka Jumpin' John, and this is my first uh, video blog that I'm making for a class in school called Survey of Radio and Television, and also kind of internet. And uh, uh, the blog is about uh, how to effectively fish along the shoreline of a lake, pond, river, stream, ocean, wherever there's a body of water and there's a shoreline. I'm going to show you how to effectively uh, fish that, or at least how, I, uh, how I've learned to, to, to do that. Uh, first off, I, I like to Excuse me. I like to be able to read a, a Bible verse out of the Bible that has really ministered to me, and I, I believe it'll touch you. Uh, now, the context of this is totally different than how I'm sharing it here, but uh, you might want to go back and, and read it and, and ask God what He thinks He wants it to be for you. So. Here's the verse. It's uh, Hebrews 10, verse 35 and 36. Uh, it says, Cast not away, therefore, your confidence, which has great recompense of reward. For you have need of patience, that after you have done the will of God, you might receive the promise. Now, um, Confidence is real important when you're out fishing, especially when you have baits, and you want to use a bait that you're confident in. And I I use five basic lures uh, that I've grown confident with, and one of those is a topwater lure right here. Um, what you do with this lure is you cast it on the water and it floats on top of the water and you begin to jig it uh, so that this part of the the, the bait uh, will cause the water to be splashed and that causes the the, the bass or, or catfish or whatever else fish there is uh, to think that that fish is scattering the bait fish and they don't want uh, one single fish to scatter the bait fish because that's their food and so uh, they attack that bait uh, the second bait uh, is called a jig uh, looks like this and you use that you cast it out and let it drop to the to the bottom and, and then you just start jigging it you, you hold the rod tip up and, and you just tweak the, the, the rod tip so that the, the bait kind of jumps along. It, bass tend to uh, uh, attack a lure when it's dropping. So the more times you cause the bait to drop, the more chances you'll have of catching a big one, you know? The third bait that I want to show is, is called a rattle trap. This one right here. Uh, this uh, unlike the other two, which are called slow retrieve baits, this is a uh, fast retrieve bait. Uh, but I, I tend to call it a medium retrieve bait because it it really gets uh, hung up on uh, tree stumps, uh, logs. Um, What else? Shoes, boots, tires, things that you don't want it to get catch, caught up on. And this one really will try your patience, uh, which that brings us back to that verse again. Uh, but this is a medium retrieve bait, and it's good for catching fish. It covers a lot of water. Uh, then my uh, next bait is called a spinner bait right here. It's got a little skirt here and it's got the hook here and 
got some blades. Uh, you, you cast this out and you retrieve it as soon as it hits the water. This is a, an extremely fast retrieve bait. And what it does is it covers a lot of water. And then my favorite lure of all time, especially during, or before and during the spawn and during the fall, uh, this will catch you a lot of fish and bass. And it's called uh, soft plastic minnow, which is right here. Uh, and you can see that uh, the 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 brand is called Storm. Um, so sorry, I'm trying to figure out. There it is, Storm. <laughs> There's my little plug uh, for the Storm Lure Company. Uh, but those those are the most effective ones. That's the one that I have the most confidence confidence in. Uh, among the others, I do have confidence in those. Uh, but what I do is I get out on the, sh the shoreline, and I'll, I'll tie on. First off, I'll use the the, the spinner bait or the the soft plastic minnow, and um, uh, what I'll do is I'll start casting off to the left side of left side of me, uh, and I'll cast three times in that direction at an angle. If I don't catch anything, I'll go straight in front of me. And I'll cast three times straight in front of me. And uh, if I catch something, great. If I don't, I keep going. I go to the to, to my right. I cast three times to the right. If I don't catch anything, this is real key. I don't stay in the place. I move on. And I take about 15 to 20 steps away from there. And I do it again. I go uh, three casts to the left. Three casts to the front and three casts to the side or to the right. And what that is is you, you're making a fan and you're covering a lot of water. And with those fast retrieve baits, which are the, 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 the soft, the soft plastic minnows and the spinner bait, uh, those will cover a lot of water quickly and you keep moving and hopefully catch a fish. That is the most effective way. Uh, I have fished, and um, if you put that to practice, and you catch something, come back to my blog, and tell me, hey, that worked. I I really did that, and have confidence. That's that's real key, because uh, people tend to give up and say, forget it. Just get out there and say, I'm going to do this, and have confidence that you're going to catch fish. Uh, so good luck. God bless you, and let them be delivered into your hands, in Jesus' name. God bless you. Bye.